Hey everyone, welcome to my channel, it's me GamerTurk and this is part 21 of my Sonic Unleashed playthrough and in fact this is take 2 on actually trying to record this episode. Last time I already completed this, recorded all those stuff up to the next episode but sadly my recording software decided to say fuck it and just mess up with all the recording files I had so here I am recording things again and I'll be editing the cutscenes in. So last episode we did the daytime stage of Jungle Joyride which was the last fully daytime stage and all we have left is the boss right here and then afterwards we're going to be doing the optional act up there that we didn't do in the last episode. But let's go. As you can see, I already completed it, but yeah, how to record it again, because fuck you two, XSplit. Here we go. We are going up against Egg Lancer. Now, Eggman's not inside, just like the... First boss battle, we are just fighting against the robots he has there. Oh, did we hit him? Uh, no, I guess not. Well, this is actually a boss that combines the first two bosses we fought. The fish thingy and the egg beetle. And it essentially combines all the powers. The lasers from the fish and yeah, the claws from egg beetle. Now it doesn't really matter if you damage him in these parts because your main damage dealer will be the end of your lap. Right here, once you finish your lap, you're getting launched into a quick time event. It's not all that hard. In my first playthrough I was expecting something more challenging but it is fairly simple. And once you complete it, you'll do a huge chunk of damage to the boss. Just repeat this without getting killed and you should be good to go. And I think if you hit him enough during these sections, you can finish him within two runs, so it still somewhat matters. Not that much, but yeah, you can finish it in two laps instead of three laps, which is always nice. And once you're doing the wall run section, do not jump because it is really a wall run section. If you jump during a wall run section, you will not be landing back to the wall, you will fall down to your death. And let's see if we can finish it in two laps. I think it's possible. Oh, come on. Okay, we need one more hit. In the previous recording, I did it in two, but whatever, we're done. And here we go, we defeated Egg Lancer, and now we got a cutscene that I will edit in. Have fun. What's wrong, buddy? Huh? Oh, right. I'm just... scared. Scared? It's just another old temple. It doesn't look like there's anyone around, either. That's... that's not what I mean. That's not... never mind. I'm fine. Let's go.
Light Gaia. I draw power from the day and light and guide the planet to its rebirth. My job was to protect the planet from Dark Gaia. But Eggman broke the world apart himself, and Dark Gaia and I were awakened before we should have been. That's why Dark Gaia broke apart, and I didn't know who I was. I didn't remember what I was supposed to do. All because this isn't the proper time of awakening. Time of awakening? Dark Gaia grows over millions of years, then rises to destroy the world. And I put it all back together. We've been doing this over and over, again and again, since the very beginning of time. So you were asleep all this time? For millions of years? Yes, for ages and ages. I bet it's thanks to you. Hmm? Even at night when I'm like this, I'm still myself, not like all the other people we've seen. You must have been protecting me this whole time. Mm-mm. I haven't done anything, Sonic. You're the reason you haven't changed at all. You're too strong to lose yourself. I'm the reason? Yeah. You never doubt yourself, no matter what. You never give in to the night or the darkness inside your heart. I think it's because I knew that about you. That's why I wanted you to help me. It's been so fun getting to see the world. I've lived here since the planet began, but I didn't know a thing about it. That it's so pretty, or that food tastes so good, or that people are so nice. I'm so glad I got the chance to discover all that with you, and I'm so glad that you helped me find my memory. Sonic, I will never, ever forget you. Thank you, Sonic. Goodbye, friend. Hey! Whoa! What? Where do you think you're off to all by yourself? What? But my memory is back now, and... Well, from here on out, it's my responsibility, so, um... I mean, there's no reason for you to come along, so I should just... Do I need a reason to want to help out a friend? Thanks, Sonic. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Yep, I actually had something to say here when I actually watched the cutscene while recording but now since I have to edit it in and I am not watching the cutscene I really have no idea what I, should, what I should be saying. I probably said something about how the movement is so natural with the animations and how much I like them compared to everything else after Unleashed like colors and generations where the animation is always so stiff but I guess that's already lost. Can you enter the stage, Sonic? There we go. Okay. So this was ported to Generations as well, just like every other Unleashed stage. And it was actually much more easier in Generations because there's a particular type of enemy here that sticks to your legs, slows you down, and then, I don't know, explodes and stuff, so... Oh, that's, that's not good. That's... 
That's expected, I always die here. Come on, let's take the lower path. Play simple, and take risks. Oh god, come on. There we go, this is going to be good. Good. Jump up. Take the upper route. And screw it all up, nice. It's not too hard, you just have to be on your toes. And not do this. Okay, this is the one, this is the one. Come on. Go. Nice rhythm. Up or out. Keep running, slide, run, jump. Right, right, one more left. And yes, this is the trickier part. With the annoying enemy I mentioned, but if you're boosting through, you can easily explode those enemies without them sticking to your foot. As you can see, we are done. Thank you! Give me the S rank. Sweet. And that was that. Hopefully with the... We're at 7 minute mark right now. Hopefully with the cutscenes it's gonna be around 13 minutes like it was originally intended. Uh, we'll, we'll, we'll see about that. Uh... You know, I, I, I was planning on uploading this episode on Saturday and continue on Sunday and Monday and probably finish by today and tomorrow, but with XSplit screwing up my recordings, uh, yeah, we're, we're here. It's Monday and I am just starting to uploading things if this recording doesn't get messed up as well. Uh, yeah. Well, thank you very much for watching. That was part 21. Hopefully the recording is not messed up and you can actually watch this on a Monday evening. Um, if you enjoyed this episode, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe for more Sonic Unleashed episodes. You can find me on Twitter at GamerTurk95 and on Facebook slash GamerTurk. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care. I am finishing this playthrough this week. No worries, no more hiccups. This is finishing this week. Thank you. See you next time.